There's an actor who can convey many different emotions with his eyes. It's Lee Byung Hun, who's known for his charismatic smile and infinite appeals. Get ready to find out all about Lee Byung Hun from the moment he debuted up until now. Lee Byung Hun began his acting career in 1991 after passing the 14th annual acting audition held by one of the major broadcasters in Korea. He was in the spotlight immediately upon his debut and showed his star potential. He starred as the lead in numerous dramas and received a lot of love from the public. <laughs> He then shared the screen with top actors Che Jin Shil, Chung Woo Sung, and Lee Young Hye in the drama The Asphalt Man, which was about a group of passionate young adults who were fearless of the uncertain future. He then starred in the 1997 drama The Beautiful Woman, which was a love story about a beautiful widow and a man with a pure heart. He appealed to the public with his charming qualities. In 1999, he gained immense popularity as the lead in the drama *Happy Together*, which delivered a story about the conflict and bond of five siblings, based on the theme of reconciliation and love. In the same year, he also captivated people through the movie *The Harmonium in My Memory*, which was like a fairy tale. Then he took a break in order to fulfill his military duty. After serving in the military as a six-month serviceman, he made a comeback in February 2000 through director Park Chan-wook's film JSA Joint Security Area. It became a smash hit at the box office, and he secured his spot as one of the top actors in the Korean film industry with high ticket power. In 2001, he starred in the romantic movie *Bungee Jumping* of their own, which followed a story of a couple who promise each other eternal love. <laughs> and the drama *Beautiful Days*, where he competed against Liu Xiwan to win the heart of a woman. <laughs> That's not all. He appeared in the music video for Jo Sung Mo's hit song "To Heaven," which opened a new chapter in the history of music videos in the K-pop industry. His kiss scene is still considered one of the most beautiful kiss scenes ever. In 2003, he was cast in the drama All In, which would become his most successful drama to date. He played the role of Kim Min Ha next to the beautiful actress Song Hye Kyo. All In was exported to Japan, and there, Lee Byung Hun gained the nickname Byun Sama. His huge popularity in Japan was evidenced at the fan meeting held there. After completing All In, Lee Byung Hun began to concentrate on his career as a movie actor. He made a transformation into a charming man who successfully seduces three sisters in the 2004 movie Everybody Has Secrets. 
That year, he even filmed the horror movie, Three Monster, a joint project of Korea, China, and Japan, and got everyone's attention with his charismatic acting. Lee Byung-hun then mesmerized all the ladies with his charms once again through the romantic movie Once in a Summer, where he portrayed Seo Kyung, a university student from Seoul who falls in love with Jung-in. In 2008, he gave a shot at filming a Western movie with other top actors in the Korean film industry and showed off his masculine appeals. He received praise for his performance in the blockbuster film The Good, The Bad and The Weird and was even invited to the Cannes International Film Festival. In 2009, he made a much-anticipated comeback to the small screens through the drama Iris, which put him in the spotlight once again. He swept numerous awards, including the Best Actor, Korean Wave Star, and Popularity Awards. Now you will die without a word. He made his debut in Hollywood and soon gained recognition overseas. He starred in the blockbuster film G.I. Joe, The Rise of the Cobra, as well as I Come with the Rain, and proved to everyone that he never settles for the present and instead takes on new challenges to take steps forward. In 2010, he created a huge stir in the Korean film industry together with the genius director of film noir, Kim ji Yoo, through the movie I Saw the Devil. <laughs> Uh, 